Confronting footage of a cassowary's last moments in the rainforest after being hit by a car and a warning that some viewers may find these images disturbing. Seriously injured, this endangered cassowary was never going to live. Struck by a motorist along Bramston Beach Road near Innisfail, the bird disappeared into thick roadside vegetation. Upon being called to the incident, environmentalist Russell Constable found the bird in a rainforest creek. A local vet was forced to euthanise it on scene. I think the big thing is just uh, for people to be aware that these birds are about and really important to our ecosystem. Kafnex Sarah Hoyle stressed it was not the driver's fault, telling he was within the speed limit and saying it was his quick actions in reporting the incident that spared the bird further pain. She said with the car travelling at 80 kilometres an hour, the 60 kilogram bird didn't stand a chance. We're really upset by the death of this cassowary yesterday. It was 20 years old, it was in its prime. Ms Hoyle says it's time urban development in wildlife corridors is capped, with just 1,500 of these birds left. CAFNIC today called for a review of all speed limits in wet tropics management areas, especially along the coast where cassowaries are known to inhabit. In that part of Bramston Beach they do see cassowaries on the road occasionally but there is an 80 km an hour speed limit. In areas around Mission Beach where there have been cassowary deaths in the past, uh, they've reduced the speed limit considerably to manage that. Anyone who hits a cassowary is urged to call the Environmental Protection Agency. Janelle Jeffrey, News. The far north is a